everyone and welcome to my studio. Today I'm going to paint a cornflower, those lovely blue flowers we see in meadows of corn occasionally, uh, being visited by a pretty pink butterfly totally from my imagination. My materials are listed in the description under the video if you'd like to go there and take a look and there are links there to the things that I'm using in case you wouldn't want to um, buy them for yourself. Now I'm starting with a very light wash of alizarin crimson to give a pink effect here and I'm just dropping in some uh, cobalt blue and a little bit of um, Windsor violet uh, to just give some impression of something pretty landing on a cornflower. And I'm going to paint this very lightly using my medium round brush and I'm going to let it dry while I start on the cornflower itself. starting to draw the stem of the cornflower using a mixture of transparent yellow and cobalt blue <clears throat> to make a green and I'm just very lightly dropping in some colors there using a very light touch and I'll just let you watch without me interfering by speaking over the top of it. starting to draw the cornflower flower itself and I've just dropped in a little cobalt blue and I'm going to develop the petals out from this center of blue. First of all darkening it down with a little bit of ultramarine and then I'm going to start to draw the, the petals coming out from the center. just starting starting to darken the center of the flower using some indigo mixed with the cobalt blue and the ultramarine just to give it some shape and by the way if you are enjoying watching this video if you would be so kind as to give me a like and to follow and perhaps pe press the bell so that you get notifications that would be greatly appreciated I'm just using some black to indicate the body of the butterfly. Now I'm going 
going to add some more shape and form and details to the wings of the butterfly. Now we're getting towards the end and I'm going to add some toothbrush spatter and perhaps some spatter using my rigger just to give a little bit more interest to the wings of the butterfly and also to construct a background so that it's not sitting in space to join it to the paper in other words make it look a little bit more at home. Finally, I'm going to put in the antennae of the butterfly just as a final finishing touch. Don't forget to like and subscribe and press the bell if you have enjoyed this video and I look forward to seeing you here again soon. So bye for now everyone, bye bye. <laughs>